Okay, here we are. Oh, look how well this works. Look at this. This is working great. Yeah, you should try it. Okay, I'm here with uh, two marvels of screen and stage. Oh my <laughs> here with my sister, Catherine, and uh, Esther, who you all know quite well. They've got amazing sunglasses on. They wouldn't let me wear the amazing sunglasses, which is fine. So what are we talking about today? What are we talking about today? We're talking about... Hello from Russia. Привет. Привет. All right, let's see. Hi from Argentina. Hey, say some stuff in Russian. Say hello to the Russians. Привет, Russians. And then more in Russian so that they know that you're not a fraud. Я все понимаю. <laughs> what does that mean? Okay. All right. So, talk about Luke. Okay, you want me to talk about Luke? I want me to talk about Luke. How about Luke's scenes yesterday? Luke doing, doing some good work. Luke, uh, Luke handling his business. And next season I'm hoping to see a lot of Luke doing a lot of stuff. And I know that we're going to get a love interest for Luke because Luke needs, Luke, Luke needs love. Luke needs love. He can't, be, he can't be always monitoring everybody else's love, love environments. You know, it's not fair to him. He's got to get his own love. He's got to get certain partners off his back, you know? Talk about Malik. Well, I don't want to talk about them right now because I feel like it's a sensitive subject right now because I feel like they're all... Things are pretty... No, they're, they're going okay. They're going okay. It's a little it's a little fight. That's all right. You know, it's just the fate of the world. Alex is just trying to do what's best for saving the world. But... <sighs> that's that. Talk about Max. That's very upsetting stuff. We're going to get more of that upsetting stuff uh, soon. But uh, can't really talk about that. That's future episodes. Getting a look. Getting a look from my producer. She's, uh, she's saying, close your mouth. Yo, boy, can we be parabatized? Sure, absolutely. Sounds great to me. Yo, Instagram is working very well. And Twitter was not working very well. And people were getting on my case saying it was my connection. But it, it's not. It's not my connection. It's the app. Not thrilled about that. What does that mean? Yeast. Yeast. I don't know. It's like here. Okay. Um, come, 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 come to Switzerland. Wait, we were supposed to talk about other things. I was supposed to talk about hummingbirds. Uh, some people were saying that I posted a photo of a bird and it wasn't a hummingbird. I was there. I took a photo of that hummingbird, but he was fluffing up his feathers because he was coming on to me. This, uh, this hummingbird was trying to show how big and strong he was, and uh, he wiggled his little hummingbird butt. I said, I'm sorry. Not my type. It's pretty, though. It's pretty, though. Hello, Brazil. Um, hola. Tell me hello. I'm not going to say it. I don't want to say it. I'm not, I'm not going to do your bidding. You have a hummingbird tattoo. That's neato. What kind of hummingbird? I saw mostly Anna's hummingbirds. And there was another one with the male name. A male human name. Hummingbirds. So I watch birds now. That's an understatement. I watch birds a lot. I've always watched birds, right? Sometimes I can go like for hours. I can go like 12 hours watching watching birds. Like, I won't stop. You're good at identifying birds. And I can identify them quite well. Because I had a little bird book when I was a kid. You should give your kids a... Uh, uh, I know all of you are old enough to have kids. You should give your kids uh, bird, <laughs> bird books. Um, it's fun to know about the things that are flying all around and get to just experience this, like, open world and they get to fly around. we got to get in planes. Not a huge fan of that because it's... You know, it takes a long time. They just flap their wings. Let's see. Why so much bird stuff? I told you this was a talk about hummingbirds. Hummingbird has the word bird in it. <laughs> bird talk. Catherine likes my... Uh, bad jokes. My bad jokes. She's, uh, she's supporting me here. So what else? What else? What else we got? Tell me more stuff. Oh, I could do something really, I could do something right now. If you tell your friends that we're chatting, 
tell him that I'm on here and I'm and I'm doing something real, real bad. Tell him I'm doing something. What, what is the outlaw yeah. stuff? What? <laughs> I'm always getting yelled at. Um, I'm always getting in trouble. Why not you? Oh, um, anybody have any suggestions for Austin, Texas? Uh, anybody down there? Anybody at at the university? Uh, anybody down there? I want to go down and have a nice time. And if you have any suggestions, or nearby, also like the the hill country in general. Um, oh, I'm not wearing green right now because I was wearing it earlier. I promise I was, and uh, I had to change. And this is green. It's just the color on the phone. It's not translating it right. I'm not wearing green pants. And I had green glasses on, but they had sparkles on them, and I wasn't allowed to wear them. <laughs> They're getting mad at me. She's talking about oh. birds and cats. Oh, yes, here's green. Product placement. Product. <laughs> oh, <okay. laughs> and the Brazil flag is green, and so thank you, Vibrito3. You have just done a great work, because now there is green in this chat. So what else are we chatting about? It's a Tuesday afternoon. It's a Tuesday afternoon. What else? You guys don't have any questions about the episode? I can't tell because only some questions get through. Sort of fly. No, that was my hair. Okay. You're, You're to nice to be an outlaw. You're too nice to be an outlaw. I'm going to get you. I'm going to outlaw the hell out of you. You want to talk about your camping? Nobody's asking any meaningful questions. I want some high effort questions. High effort. Do hummingbirds hum? Vocally, they don't hum. They make a nice kind of um, squeaky noise. And uh, actually, it's a very varied sound. But they're also very mean and territorial. And they do this thing where they defend the area that they feed at very aggressively. And they have a dive bombing method, which looks very intimidating because they're, yeah, they poke like this, like that. And then so sometimes smaller ones will come around and the larger ones will uh, frighten them off. Oh, my phone's dying. That's what that is, by the way. <sighs> what did Kat ask? You're all saying Kat asked a question. What did she ask? All of you simultaneously tell me what Kat asked. So that one of the questions can get through. You guys are not, this is, okay, you, okay, no, come on. What do you think about Sebastian? You know what I think about Sebastian. I think that he's still a very friendly guy who's just misunderstood. He's misunderstood. There's a complex, complex man underneath all that, <laughs> underneath all that charred skin. <laughs> I think it'd be funny if Alec has another love interest from Malik. All that demon, all that demon. Good news, good cows. For next week's episode, what should we expect from next week's episode? Hmm. Hmm. I should go to the water park in Austin. I gotta be honest. I don't know how I feel about water parks. <laughs> yeah, y'all, y'all been to water parks before? What's one thing we know about water parks? Filled with pee. And band-aids. And band-aids. It's always a band-aid. There is. But they're really fun before you start to realize that. Yeah, you realize that there's now, there's what? There's, you know, there's here, there's 5,000 people sharing this water with me. And all 5,000 of them are the most hygienic people on the planet. I want to go to the most exclusive high-end water park ever where I'm exclusive not grossed out. Exclusive high-end water park. Where I'm not grossed out by the pee and the band-aid. But no, but you see, it doesn't matter. Exclusive doesn't matter. There's still people are unhygienic equally true, across all, true. across all, you know. So I don't think it matters. I think ultimately it's just, you know, you get in, you just accept that you're, you're bathing with people. You're bathing with huma humanity. All of humanity is bathing with you. That goes for hot tubs. Hot tubs too. Ah, I can't do hot tubs. Can't do them. Get in there. No. It's just brewing. Just brewing. Somebody's calling me. I feel like that phone number is like a, uh, a, a work call. Like, stop with your huh? 
Oh, it's a, uh, uh, yeah. What? Stop calling me. No, it's not. Somebody else closed it. Oh, okay. Well, let's see. Do I like trampolines? Yeah, I love trampolines. I love the, uh, what is it, like 50,000 hospital visits a year for broken bones caused by trampolines? See, now we're getting into an actuarial talk, aren't we? A risk talk. This oh, flies. Man. Drive me nuts. You like roller coasters? You know I, like, I like trampolines. Hey. Yeah, I broke my arm once. Why didn't Why didn't Alec grab the lobster with his mouth? From oh. the fork? Are you serious? Is that something you, you want to do? You want to be fed by the person? I mean, there's something about that. It's dehumanizing, being fed by another human being. It's true, it is. Yeah. It's dehumanizing to feed someone like that and then have them eat from your hand. It's not dehumanizing, it's just preference. It's preference? Yeah. You... I feel it's dehumanized. So you don't do it. I don't do it. <laughs> and Alec doesn't do it either. Lobster is a very personal food, though, because you kind of get all up in there. Well, here's the other thing, by the way. <laughs> That's very sweet. The other thing is, by the way, when you eat lobster, right? So you know how film sets work. So lobster's out there sitting on that table. I know it's kind of fresh, right? But really, you know... It's a lot of hours, you're sitting there and you're eating cold lobster and obviously our sets and our crew is very good at replacing and everything, but there's always that thing in the back of your mind, which is after your 50th piece of, piece of lobster. Piece of lobster. Piece of lobster. <laughs> you're, you're not in the mood for more lobster. How many of you could eat that much lobster? <laughs> how, how many of you... What the fuck? How many of you could eat that much lobster? All right. Well, you all seem like you're being very nice. I'm not getting all the questions, unfortunately. I can't call you. I don't know your number. But if I did, I would have called you right now if I had your number. I would have called you. So you missed the opportunity there. Uh, here's the deal. Um, it's been lovely chatting. I really don't have anything else to say because I, this is not a good method. I think you guys were right. The best, the best method is to tweet directly online with words. That's definitely the best method. So that's what I'll do. Um, at first opportunity or next time I really I see some good questions some high effort questions and um, yeah I hope you guys liked our interview at, at San Diego Comic Con I thought we did some good some good chatting we had a lot of fun what's up and, Sarah Bear um, what's up girl <laughs> hi Sarah and uh, hi, Cat. Apparently, who's watching too? And hi, who anyone, anyone else is watching? You didn't talk about Malik. I, you, you haven't been here long enough. You haven't <laughs> been here long enough. You, you're jumping in here, and you're telling me what you think, what you, what you thought you saw. But I did. I clarified why I'm not discussing Malik. And and you guys will understand a little better in the next coming weeks. So y'all, y'all sit on that. Let that marinate. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna go now. You let that marinate, and uh, <laughs> yeah. Next season, Alec is going to be a sword-wielding, axe-wielding nut job, fighting his way through Idris to solve crimes, solve problems, and put an end to this mystery villain named Sebastian, or whatever his real name is, Jonathan Sebastian. Demon Toast Man. Alright. <laughs> I was outside with my dog. Excuses! <laughs> Excuses. You should never play with your dog. Just prepare yourself for potential Instagram videos. Alright. Uh, love you guys. Hope you guys are all being lovely and nice. Please don't get mad at me this week for something that I've done. Oh, I'm trying please. my hardest not to cause problems. I don't know. Sometimes, I don't know. And if something does happen, alert me. And I'll try to clarify whatever happens. I don't know. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting texts from your favorite, your favorite trio. All right. I'll see you guys. Bye-bye. Hello, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, Germany. Goodbye, everybody. Thanks for the nice hat. I'm gonna get mad.
Love y'all. All right, bye-bye. All right, now here's the whole process. They seem to like it when I do this, but I honestly, I don't know how this works. Boop, See, I press boop, it, boop, and then what I press? Boop, I press the live button. Nope, boop, it tells me how long I've been here. Boop, oh, end. And then I do end.